contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the United States Championship. The legendary Rey Mysterio! Making his way to the ring from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, Rey Arguably one of the most inspirational superstars we've ever seen accomplish everything in his career. WWE's Apex Predator. And his opponent, from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, he is the Apex Predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. Few WWE superstars have fared as well throughout their careers as Randy Orton. Cool, calm, collected, but laser focused. And ready to explode at a moment's notice with an RKO out of nowhere. recently etched his name in history as one of WWE's few Grand Slam champions, and the Viper has shown no signs of slowing down, just as dangerous now as the day he burst on the scene. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. And I wouldn't at all be surprised Yikes. if this match stole the show here tonight. Into a power bomb. I have to tell you, the RKO table in play. Here's the cover, and it's Randy Orton able to stop the count. Not yet, too early. Corey, it still amazes me how quickly Randy Orton can strike an opponent with the RKO. Obviously, the WWE Universe feels the same way since the hashtag out of nowhere trends on social media whenever the Viper uncoils. It doesn't matter if an opponent is behind Randy Orton, in front of him, attacking him. The Viper is always one RKO from victory. Now setting him up one more time. Oh! 
Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. He may have to start reevaluating his game plan. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment oh, tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. He delivers a flawless Hurricane Rana. Ooh. Hurricane Rana beautifully executed. Guys, you never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014. And now he goes for it a second time. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. He's making a statement here with this attack. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. That's right up there, Michael, but let's not forget that was also the match where Kane went through a flaming table. Flying Mayorana! Over the years, Rey Mysterio has certainly developed a global following. And guys, it's amazing to see how far he's come since his early days being trained by his uncle in Mexico. Here we go again. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Incoming. Gets out of the way of that one. Dodges a bullet there. Speaking again of Mysterio's training in Mexico, it's there that Mysterio really got in touch with his Lucha Libre roots and where he developed his undeniable style that wows audiences worldwide today. That's great, but let's be honest. Mysterio was just another luchador before he came over to the United States and started to make a name for himself. First in ECW, then in WCW, and eventually WWE. Boom! Oh, what a drop kick! On the mark. In a career filled with highlight, Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Carana through the table. It's over. We've got to see that again, guys. So nice. You got to see it twice. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. The champ comes into this match incredibly motivated, though all the motivation in the world might not help here tonight. The thing about Mysterio's Royal Rumble match victory that you guys mentioned is not only did he come in at number two, but he also had to last more than an hour just to be the last man standing. And even more impressive is the list of superstars Mysterio eliminated, highlighted, of course, by Triple H and the man he eliminated last to win the whole thing, Randy Orton. Moves. What acrobatics. After decades in the sports entertainment business, I feel like we know Rey Mysterio fairly well, but Corey, there's still that element of mystery when it comes to Rey, isn't there? Ah, uh, yeah, that's because that mask he wears, Cole. I'm telling you, he's hiding something from us. I just know it. Why else would he wear that mask? Byron should wear one. Agreed. Hey. Hurricane Rana. Good grief. Unlike Corey, who is clearly a conspiracy theorist, I don't believe Rey Mysterio is hiding something from us underneath his mask. It's just part of his Lucha Libre heritage. Oh, don't get me started on Lucha Libre. They're all hiding something. Kalisto, Lince Dorado, Sin Cara. Can't trust any of them.
Ladies and gentlemen, Rey Mysterio's exploits in WWE have been well documented, but let's not forget Mysterio was also quite successful in WCW prior to the company being sold in 2001. Oh boy, he is rolling. Judging from the feeling inside this arena, I think this crowd knows they may very well witness history here in this match. What a leg drop. To illustrate just how successful Mysterio was in WCW, as Michael stated, in addition to capturing the Cruiserweight and Tag Team Championships, Mysterio was also one half of the WCW Cruiserweight Tag Team Champions. Yeah, let's be honest. With the WCW Cruiserweight Tag Team Champions, look out! The champ to the top turnbuckle. Did you see how much air he got on that? Real quick reminder, guys, there are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Oh boy, he is rolling. Reverses that one. Up against the barrier now. I think that barrier might be the only thing holding him up. I think you're right. Watch Sit out, Jawbreaker! You can pick up your teeth in the third row. As Corey mentioned, there's a treasure trove of weapons under the ring. Everything from kendo sticks to steel chairs to fire extinguishers. If you can think about it, it's probably under there. And when that's the case, it's not a matter of if you're going to get hurt. It's a matter of how badly you're going to get hurt. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Over 15 years into his WWE career, there were a few firsts left for Randy Orton to conquer. But he found one when he beat Bobby Roode and captured the United States Championship for the very first time. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, and Randy Orton has been busted open. Rey Mysterio, so damaging. That has got to be it. Michael mentioned Randy Orton's United States title win and true to Orton form, it came out of nowhere. After a quickly intensifying rivalry, the Viper beat the Glorious One at Fastlane for the one title he had yet to claim. And in the process, Orton became only the 10th person in WWE history to become a Grand Slam champion, which requires you hold the tag titles, the United States title, Intercontinental title, and a WWE championship. Another apex for the Apex Predator. Unleashing it for the second time now. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. He's got him now. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. There it is, Rey Mysterio just put the exclamation point on this match. Now that's how you successfully defend your title. Concentrating on the body here. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Wow, let's see that again. Man, he is simply a walking highlight reel. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. There's the Irish whip. And Randy Orton just slips out of harm's way. The WWE Champion. And RKO! That might have done it, Cole. Here's a cover. One! And the fight must go on. Just needs to do more damage. This has been a battle. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Randy Orton, this kind of offense he's known for. The Viper strikes again. I love it. The night could be over for Rey Mysterio. He's flipped the script here.
The WWE Championship is on the line. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Randy Orton was just one step behind there, guys. Truly spectacular. When this guy's on, look out. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. An unbelievable neckbreaker. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. This is what makes him one of the best in the bit. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Uh-oh. Whoa, did you see what he just did? Incredible! He hits him with the knee. Back now inside the ring. Here we go. Back inside the ring. The WWE Championship is on the line. Amazing move there. And Randy Orton just slips out of harm's way. Oh boy, he is rolling. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Game, set, match. This one is over. Randy Orton got the worst end of that stick. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Second time's a charm. Obviously putting a lot of stock in that maneuver. He's got him covered. One, two, barely at two and a half. How in the world? He's making a statement here with this attack. At what point do those thoughts creep in of, what do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Rey Mysterio looking for something. There he is. Rey Mysterio just put the exclamation point on this match. Gotta like the chance chances now. And he got a near fall out of it. Gonna take more than that. Both of these superstars looking a little worse for wear right now. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. Oh, going to the top, high risk. Rey Mysterio looking for something. There it is. Rey Mysterio just put the exclamation point on this match. That's how you put an exclamation point on the, the cover. And this one's history. What a win. Man, that Extreme Rules match is one of the best I've ever seen. It was incredible. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic.
That's a big win for him, ladies and gentlemen. The Apex Predator fell prey to a better opponent tonight. I can't believe it happened.